We're here at the Rock the Game Pep Rally at the Seminole Hard Rock Hotel and Casino in Sinbad Sports, of course. We have former Alabama players, we have former Notre Dame players, and they're all here to get the crowd hype for tomorrow's 2013 DCS National Championship. Let's take a look at the action. Danielle Lynn here, continuing coverage at Sinbad Sports for the Rocky Game Pep Rally. I am here with none other than Jerome Bettis. Jerome, where do we start? The buzz, you know, six-time Pro Bowler, three-time All-Pro, comeback back player of the year, rookie of the year, coach of the Super Bowl. But, going back to college, Notre Dame has not won a national championship since 2019, about 27 years ago. What does it mean to you to come back and have a chance to get uh, you know, it's special because uh, you know Notre Dame hasn't been relevant uh, on the football stage, the college football stage, in, in about you know, 15 years. So we have an opportunity to play for a national championship. Uh, it, it means a lot to, to not only myself but to everyone that ever wore uh, that Notre Dame jersey, uh, put that helmet on, because you know we wanted to have that opportunity. We never got it, and uh, to see these young men have this opportunity is just great. Of course, like you said, Notre Dame alumni, they're around the country rallying up. They're so excited to get another chance. What is it? This is going to be ring number nine if they do get it, correct? I believe so, if they do get it. And it'll be, it'll be one of those that, obviously, being an underdog and, and having an opportunity to win. So if you do win this one, this one you know, becomes really special because I think of all of them, probably, this would be the one that they were probably the most unexpected to win. Obviously, Alabama is a juggernaut, you know, a, a great football team. So uh, they can pull this one out and keep going for the ages. Have you had a chance to talk to any of the players? And so what are you talking about? You know what? I stayed away from that. I think this is their moment and they need to enjoy it, uh, but also, you know, be ready you know, for it. So I, I just want them to go out and, and play and, and uh, play like champions. I like champions, well, like both of you. Now, looking at Alabama, looking at Notre Dame, what do you think the key is for Notre Dame to come out here for pull on well, I think it's just important for them to slow down the running game. I don't think you can stop that running game. They've got a really, really good uh, group of offensive linemen and running backs. So it's going to be difficult to stop them. I think you want to slow them down, manage them, um, and, and try to, you know, corral them uh, to the point where they're only scoring, you know, 14, 17 points. And, and offensively, uh, I think that's where the Notre Dame uh, offense has to play really special. Uh, Everett Bolton has to really – attack the edges of that defense, put some pressure um, on them, uh, but also complete some passes down the field so that the running game can really open up. And I think if they can do that, um, they've got a great chance of winning the game. Now, will you be in attendance over here to watch? Absolutely, I'll be there. I'll be there uh, with, uh, with my, 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 my cheerleading uh, out for that. <laughs> Bus bet is tomorrow at the 2013 BCS National Championship game, of course, right here in South Florida. Now, let's continue the coverage here at Sinbad Sports for the Rock the Game Cup Rally. Just maybe some of the biggest Alabama fans I've seen today. Tell me why you're an Alabama fan. I'm from Alabama. All I know is road, tie, road. Mm -hmm. the bloodline. The bloodline. And all the way down. From my granddaddy to my great granddaddy, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> all right, now how long did it take you guys to travel south Florida? Yeah. It took us about, we come from uh, Atlanta. It took us about nine and a half hours. Nine and a half hours? We yeah. drove. We drove. Now, Energy. how? Confident, but three of you, the Alabama's taking home championship title. Uh, two, two touchdowns, taking all bits. I touchdowns. called Saban and I told him, don't call the dogs. <laughs> <laughs> all right, score predictions. We got two touchdowns for you. Five touchdowns. Five touchdowns. Five touchdowns. Woo, you went bold. <laughs> all right, now, look in the camera and tell the Alabama fans and the Alabama football players one thing. What do you want to tell them? Roll, tight, roll. Don't let up. Push it to the limit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you guys. Enjoy the day.